Hello, children. I'm Vicki Carlton, and I love telling children stories, especially stories from the Bible. It's a beautiful day outside today. It's a bit, a bit cool, but the sun is shining brightly, and I've been doing lots of gardening lately. So I've been getting plants and taking some of the weeds out of them and taking off all the, the brown bits, the bits that got burnt over summer, making sure they get a little bit more water. And I've also been thinking about planting another grapevine because I eat lots and lots and lots of grapes. My family really love grapes as well. And as you can see, I've got a beautiful vineyard behind me. But do you know, we, we have a gardener who, who gardens for us. Like all of us have a special gardener that helps us to get really healthy on the inside. And that gardener is Jesus. Now, this is a this is um, a little bit of the Bible, a little story about Jesus, and it's from the Gospel of John, and it's from John 15. And it's a time that, that Jesus was with his friends, and I like to think that, you know, maybe they were walking in the vineyard, right? And this is why Jesus told them this story. Because Jesus actually said to his friends, I am the grapevine and you are my branches. And you can see behind me that there are some branches on this grapevine. And of course, what Jesus means is that he, he is the main part of our life and we are branched off from him. So God, God is our gardener and he grows the vine. And of course, we are all part of the vine. And if we stick close to Jesus, we will bear fruit. We will bear fruit like these beautiful, juicy grapes. So Jesus says, even when things get really hard for you, and they do sometimes, don't they? Stay close to me and I will look after you. If you stay close to me, you will bear fruit like these beautiful grapes. So I don't know whether you like green grapes or, or black grapes. I think I prefer black grapes. Looking at these grapes behind me makes me feel really hungry. But if we stay close to Jesus, we will bear amazing fruit as well. And the fruit that we will bear will be things like being kind, working hard, staying close to Jesus, telling people about God as well. So what, what Jesus said was, listen to my words, obey my rules. All right, so we've got to remember the rules. So we've got the Ten Commandments and then we've got the rule where Jesus said that we need to love one another. I want you to grow and follow me. I chose you and I love you very, very much. So if we stay close to God, if we stay close to God and if we pray, if we read the Bible, if we go to church, if we tell people about Jesus, then we're going to stay very, very close to Jesus, Jesus who is our grapevine, Jesus who is our gardener, and he will look after us. He will look after us and he will help us when times get tough. He will help us when times are going really well. He will help us whenever we need it. He will be there for us. So aren't we lucky that we've got our own heavenly gardener? All right. Thank you so much for listening to my story and I look forward to talking to you next time. And now I'm off to go and have a snack of juicy grapes. Bye. For more of Victoria Carlton's tips, go to YouTube and search Victoria Carlton Programs. Victoria's products are available on Teachers Pay Teachers. They cover literacy, emotional intelligence, and Sunday school lessons. Victoria's website address, blog, 
and email address are on the screen in front of you. Victoria Carlton reserves the right of copyright on all her products.